Hi everyone. We are not having a good night. So we had a video of plans. We've spent money on the video. Time. We've spent time on the video. And the video turned to shit. We were going to do a literal catwalk making plums costumes. They always say, don't work with kids or animals. And yeah. I can totally, like, why didn't we think of that? Because plum is a child and an animal. Yeah, we understand that now. This is actually what went down. quite work out the video never actually got done we felt too bad we thought we were gonna look like we were mean parents abusing plums so we thought we'd scrap that idea and we go to our backup idea which was a pancake challenge video that we filmed last year and we thought we'll use that one day it'll be fine boring so boring terrible video first idea bailed our backup sucked so now we're literally we're just I don't even what are we doing we are having a little drink of pineapple juice and, and nothing else. Nothing else but pineapple juice. We're gonna answer some questions and we're gonna do origami. What should we call it? Cra crafts and- Crat. No, crafts and chalk, chalk crafts. Oh, okay. Oh, there's some strong pineapple juice. I know how to make a crane, so I'm gonna do that, but there's instructions in here, so you can do whichever one. Oh, can I just follow you? Okay, let's get into the questions. What stands between you and complete happiness? Can we save that one till we've had a few more pineapple juices? <gasps> At the moment, what stands between me and happiness stands between is me. some ice, because my drink is warm. <laughs> Oh, fuck, you started. You have to take off the other bit as well. I don't oh. remember if I'm doing what this What other bit? Oh, there. What will people say at your funeral? I told him to stop bloody poking that bear at the zoo. Because that's how I would have died. Poking a bear. And then they'd be like, damn it, I told him. What will people say at my funeral? She was oh, a bit yeah. of a mess, but she tried well. <laughs> I think that's honestly what people would say. They'd be like, she did her best. It'll be like one of those report cards that you got when you were like 15. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Guy does well, but he could do better. <laughs> yeah, I wave the theories. Meg I've was okay, that. but she could have done better. <laughs> Standing at the gates of heaven. Yeah. And God asks you, why should I let you in, Guy? What's up, man? Can't believe you're here. God's at the front gate. What do you say? God, bro. Meg's in there. And so I'm, I died first. You died. I can cope. So I went to the zoo instead of poking a bear. Yeah. Um, I'm like, oh god, dude. Um, Meg's in there, and I'm a sober driver, and she doesn't. I'm here, and my phone's dead. Can you let me in so I can grab her? And he'll be like, yeah, totally. And then he'll realise once I'm already in there that it's not a club. And he'll be like, oh, oh got me again, cheeky fucker. <laughs> and then he'll okay. just let me stay in. What are you, what are you saying to God? I tried my best. <laughs> And I know like, hey, that buddy, it wasn't amazing, up. but I, I really tried sometimes. I really tried. Oh, did you say crane? <laughs> I thought you said plane. <laughs> oh. uh, if you lost everything tomorrow, whose arms would you run into to make everything better? ACC, <laughs> obviously. What's ACC? <laughs> Insurance. That's not... ACC is accident claim, so if you hurt yourself oh, at work. Well, insurance. insurance like AMI. Oh, AMI, I'd go to house insurance because I lost everything and they would make everything better because we're insured. So. With ACC apparently. If you could send a message to the entire world, what would you say in 30 seconds? <laughs> hey, hey Will, how's it going? Oh shit, no you can't respond. Um, okay, fuck. Uh, not all of you can understand me because there are so many different well, languages around the world. What would I say? 30 seconds. I tell everyone that I can count the alphabet backwards. She can actually, and I would say that's showing off, but I'm happy for you to show this off. Yeah, I can do it. Alphabet backwards, go. Z Y X W V U T S I Q P O N M L K J I G H F E D C A. It's a completely pointless skill, but at the same time, it's so impressive. What would you change about your life if you knew you would never die? That's kind of insinuating the fact of like, would you splurge? <laughs> I want to zoom a bit. If you knew you would never die, that's insinuating that it's allowing us to do something that would probably kill us. Like, 
Oh, do you know what? I wouldn't like that because I find it hard enough to save for the next five years. Imagine if you get to save for the rest of your life. What? What are we on about saving for? Because if you're never going to die, Guy, you're going to need a plan. Do you just grow old to 100 and then you just stop growing old? Because if you go to 100, you're going to need a bigger time at fun. Save money on life insurance though, wouldn't you? Fuck, why are you talking about insurance so much? <laughs> it's on my mind that you me. How would you describe yourself in five words? God, why are these questions like getting us to analyze our lives? Because they're called 74 thought-provoking questions to get you pondering. So I thought that'd be... It's going to get everyone else pondering. They're going to be like, why did I hit subscribe? Why am I watching this? Yeah. When you're 90 years old, what will matter most to you in the world? Probably a... Dentures. Yeah, or like a like a sphincter that holds its grip. You know? A good bed. Oh, good bed. Um, nice slippers. Being able to remember shit. A light handbag. One of those whiz mobility <gasps> scooters. Yeah, one those of those things like are electrical fucking fun. things. They're bright. And also, you can say whatever the fuck you want when you're an old person. Yeah, I like, like that. Somebody, like, you could do the most heinous things, and they could be like, it's alright, he's old. Yeah. I don't know. My name is a bit like I could that. punch a kid and they'd be like, oh, he's just old. Leave me. It's cute. When was the last time you tried something new? I had a, a vegetarian curry pie the other day. Never had that before and it was delicious and I don't regret it. An insight into how interesting our lives are. <laughs> that after a, about 10 seconds of thought, the latest new thing that Meg has tried is a pie a few days ago. And why am I judging? I haven't said anything yet. I can't think of anything new. That's more sad. Okay. Yeah, it's no, worse. Like you must have had something new. <laughs> you must have done something I don't like this question. It's too thought provoking. What can you do today that you couldn't do a year ago? What will be able to do? What will you be able to do? What? What will you be able to do at this time next year? We hadn't started YouTube a year ago, so I wouldn't be able to talk to you guys and do this. Uh, and what will we be doing next year? Oh, I don't know. I don't know what this year I was turning into. This is a really bad sign. This could be a. Uh, this actually, right now, this video could be us stepping off our peak and going down. <laughs> This could be where our down all began. Wow. We didn't get very high, did we? Would you rather have 10 years of excellent health or 30 years of average health? Average health. Oh, I'm, li way. I'm, I'm 24 years into my 30 years of average health. <laughs> We're just getting by. <laughs> I mean, our tests and everything are fine, but you know, it's if I mean, went for we're like drinking a... <laughs> on, a, on a Thursday night. If so. I, um, pineapple juice. If I went to the doctor and had like a full body checkup, he'd be like, I mean, you could improve. I'd be like, but am I gonna die? It's I'd be like, it, no. I'd be like, well, there we go. It comes back to the whole thing of, you did your best. <laughs> <laughs> That's all we can ask for. Do you just want to tell a funny story? I just want to tell a funny story. Well, it's all right. The video's downhill anyway. I went to America a few years ago with my good friend Steph. This is my favorite stories of all time. And we're in the Las Vegas uh, security check. Uh, obviously, we were going through putting our bags through. You guys have way, way more security checks than we do here in New Zealand. We pretty much just like just wander on through, and nobody really checks. Security anything. at New Zealand airports, like, are you a bad guy? They They're don't like, even nope, check your like, passport. Come on in. <laughs> they don't check your passport if you're going domestic. All you have to do is scan your bag once, and you're done. Yeah, it's easy as, but it was pretty full on going from Las Vegas to to where were we going? Los Vegas, Angeles, somewhere. Vegas. See ya, plum. So we're going through the security. It was amazing. I was getting scanned full body. And then we <laughs> went to the end. We came to pick up our bags. And there was a guy in front of us uh, who had his big black kind of suitcase bag in front of us. And the woman who was security was like... You need to tell the story quickly because it's low battery. Okay, it's worth it. Um, the woman was like, Sir, what's in your bag? And he's like... <laughs> normal stuff, toothbrush, toothpaste, clothes, nothing out of the ordinary. And she's like, sir, I'm going to open up your bag. And he was like, okay, go ahead. And I'm sitting literally right next to him, like, here's, here's the yeah. person, here's guy, here's me. And she unzips the bag and a cat, <laughs> and a cat jumps out and the woman's like, sir, what is this? 
That's where she went wrong. Oh. And then he goes, it's my cat. <laughs> That's where she went wrong. Instead of saying, sir, what is this? She's gone, you lied. The and cat's I go, out of the Oh, bag. come on! All right, let's leave him laughing. Potentially, you might thought that was fucking terrible. This was our first episode and probably our last of crafts and shit. Did we even craft? You made two. I made some two trains. I made a plane. We'll try and do some Pinterest stuff next time. If, if you enjoyed stuff. this video, give it a thumbs up. Give us a subscribe, and we'll see you on Wednesday. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Bye. <laughs>